Okay, let's go. Hey there, Ranger Squad, and welcome back to another stream. I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you guys are doing good. Um, welcome back to another stream. Unfortunately, I did not stream yesterday because the reset for the keys and the Subarus gems did not come until today. So it is a Tuesday, and the Subarus gems have reset to 120 as well as the keys, so I can buy more keys during this entire run. Um, yes, um, I'm very, very, you know, very time strategizing everything that I need to work on, so we'll just get on with the stream and see what we're going to do next. Obviously, you've seen the title, we're going to grind some keys, we're going to do boss rush attempts, and yeah, it's going to be a great experience from this one person who streams another Eden on a daily basis. And speaking of a daily basis, I decided I have planned out my streaming, um, streaming, uh, schedule. So, as I go along the time, timeline of what I'm going to be doing on my streams, I'm now seeing a pattern. So, every Tuesday to Saturdays, I'm going to be streaming. So, I'm going to only be streaming five days. And it could either be... Final Fantasy or Dissidia Opera Omnia. So those are the two games that I'm currently playing. And I will say this though. I recently did finally beat Moon Spirit Kakara, aka Tuva Another Styles Manifest Weapon. I was shaking after I beat Moon Spirit Kakara. I had to use a strategy, and luckily, Will Max saved me because I used this strategy. Thank you, Will Mac, by the way. If you don't know who Will Mac is, he is a fellow Another Eden player. He's been playing on the platform for two years, so it's great to have him on the platform with the Another Eden community. But I used this strategy, but instead of using Arrow Thrust, um, I use Arrow Magic on Arrow. Mariel. So then I would use Mana with Queen of Hearts and to just lower its magic down as well as Midnight Cendralon when Dark Deal is applied to that manifest weapon battle. And obviously I use AS Claude, Filmina, and Yuri on the team to do more DPS and I finally did it. I tweeted about it on Twitter I mentioned Another Eden saying, Dear Another Eden, I finally beat your toughest manifest battle of all time. I finally did it. Sincerely yours, me. And then Another Eden replied to that same tweet that I did and said congratulations, which is very, very helpful. Now, I was going to make a video about this, but I decided to, you know what, I'm just going to post the way that I'm talking of how I did the strategy. So, this might go up on my main channel or on the second channel, but I'll probably have to edit it down first so that I can have you guys know what the heck happened. I'll talk about it. It's going to be a quick talk, and that was the talk earlier. <laughs> that earlier was the talk, so I think it's going to go up on my main channel, but who knows? I'm just going to talk about it afterwards. So, without any further ado, let's get on with grinding keys, and obviously I have my... Oh, why is it low? Okay, that was strange. The internet. Um, okay. Let's go, I guess. So, we're gonna use this team to grind in Zerberia, the crystal region. I got five keys full, and we're ready to go. So, this is gonna be like speedrunner, I guess. I hope I can get my very first Hecantakari Codex, if, if that ever happens. Oh, I should have Lunatic. I mean, she's gonna crit it anyways. Crit! Oh, well, we had Mer we had Nostrari to take care of that. <laughs> nice. We're just gonna go through this into higher place. Oh, 
Ooh, that was so clean, so strong. I love using, I love using Violet. And speaking of Violet, I have not finished Persona 5. I don't have Persona 5 Royal, I have the original Persona 5. Because I think Persona 5 Royal is just an add-on plus the grappling hook and the add-on to a brand new content to the storyline that is Persona 5. So, obviously I don't have Persona 5 Royal, but I love watching it, so, yeah. Okay, crit it, crit it, crit it. <gasps> oh no, that was scary. That was scary. Let's go in here. Hopefully this is a rare map, and no. So, what I'm guessing is that the Clear Heavens floor is not the rare map, but the Azure floor is the rare map. So we have to be mindful of that. And I forgot to bring up um, the wiki site of Another Eden, so I don't know. Like I've been to this I've been to this dungeon so many times. Oh, murmur script. Noise. I should switch in with AS Domina for a for an instant stun on the enemy. And this guy is absolutely weak to This guy is weak to Crystal and wing type attacks. Organized Okay, nice. We did it so well. And also, I would like to mention these two people who have followed on my channel. So thank you to SefiCard87 and Ariel Faye for the follow. Um, Ariel Faye followed my my Twitch channel two days ago and SefiCard87 just followed me yesterday. So thank you guys for the follow. I hope you guys will enjoy the streams that I'm going to be doing for basically the rest of summer. Vacation. Yes, I'm on summer vacation. I'm on summer break. And we're go I'm going back to school on August in the month of August. So that has my Okay, Sea of Clouds is not the rare map. I need to bring up the wiki site for a second. Give me. Okay. Crystals of Okay, I'm, I'm bringing it up so I can figure out where what am I talking about. So if you know me from Wattpad, I recently posted or published episode another episode of Ask the TNBS Cast, which is the another e the newbie shot the newbie shot cast featuring the Crestland Orphans, um, Shiro Hama, Akira Takashi, McCarter Adler, and Himari Tora. So, yeah. So if you guys are into reading stories, then you can go check out my Wattpad. It's Kawaii underscore Yandere 234 if you guys want to check that out. And if you enjoy, if you've known me for a very long time, you know that I write a lot of stories a day. Antiquity Zerberia, so perfect. I'm bringing, I have brought it up. You gotta, gotta do the crits. You gotta do the crit! Oh, I should have not given him attack. I should have not given Lone Wolf Storm because... Clarté and Felmina are like the best duo to come in here. Perfecto. Obviously, there aren't any pictures of the map at the moment on the wiki site. However, I know what I'm doing here. I'm no. So the ooh, the Coz Hound or the mean dogs that uh, outspeeds you all the time is weak to crystal, pierce, and magic attacks. And with the Calcedo, it's weak to crystal, slash, and pierce attacks. For Morgarita, it's weak to wind and the crystal attacks, so there is no exceptions to resistance to... Well, it has have a resistant to... It is resistant to... Um, pierce and slash attacks, but if it's like a wind type attack, 
then it's not weak to it, so we're good to go. Also, I am managing the stream on my on my laptop so you guys so I can get the full experience of not having to pause in between seeing your guys's um twitch um twitch comments what was I going to twitch chat okay. Ooh, the what do we get a murmur script. I hope we can get a shadow for my boy, my boy Claute. Let's go. Let's go for it. I don't have my AF bar up, so we're just going to wing it. Oh shoot! What did it just do? What did it cancel out? Oh, it, I thought it canceled out Chaos Saber. Nope. So let's hit it with all we have. And there we go. That was perfect. <laughs> and oh shoot, that scared me. Um, it was my. I'm using a portable fan, like you would see in like a Five Nights at Freddy's game. Yeah, that was the sudden drop that just happened. I was, I was like so scared. <laughs> okay, we got Super's gems. That's ten for the first ten. That's the first ten that we got. And no shadow for Clart. Clarté. I would like to say it in an accent. A Clarté. Pilgrim's way. Okay, let's bring in these guys. Perfecto. And this time we're gonna lunatic. We're gonna lunatic. Um, activate lunatic on Mistrare, and we can get the crit. We can get the double attack. And then we're gonna do it by it. There, there, there. Oh, it did not kill! That's so, that pixel of a health! That's, that's, wow. Wow. That was, whoo, interesting. Okay, there's something, there was something on my phone and I had to scratch it off. This is a new phone, and I've had this for, like, two, three weeks now. Yeah. Get it before it hits. Oh, thank goodness. Thank you, Clart. So, I was told during a Will Max stream yesterday that how am I supposed to upgrade the Ring of Brilliance, a.k.a. Clarte's personal armor, and they s and one of them said, "Well, you can't upgrade the Ring of Brilliance yet. You have to do. You can do it in Chapter Nine, aka Lunatic Code. So we'll have to wait for Chapter Nine to drop. Luckily, it's not an update too far, because the next update it will feature A.S. Sigre, who is a Water Zone Setter, who is a Water Zone Zo Zone Zone Setter, and he is." Obviously, the AS form of of a, of Shigure, and considering that I have Shigure with me, I'm I'm I don't know if I'm going to be grinding out the treatises that he needs to be upgraded to an AS form. So we're in the clear heavens floor. This is not the Azure floor just yet. Okay, we could just hit it. Perfecto. Let's switch in. To make it more fair, I guess. Let's go. Man, I love Clarte's wings. I I I just love wings in particular. Hit it! Okay, uh, who was, uh, what did you say? Yeah. Yeah, Yuri. He is the only male, male water zone sucker. And for some reason, you wanted to use water zone. <laughs> I mean, I mean, uh, that's stage three. I mean, I do have a wind zone. But 
there are other strategies that don't require you to have a pierce zone. And then... <laughs> okay, we're just gonna move on. I mean, you can use shield in it. Shield's a boy. It's a trap. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna move on. So thank you for the small reminder. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Okay, that's good. That's good. So, wait, how am I supposed to pronounce your name? Yuri Vic? Yuri Vich? Or just, I'm just gonna call you Yuri. I'm just gonna call you that. Hmm, yeah, true. I mean, Claude AS form can deploy a wind zone, and that was before AS Vena or Vena came out. Hardy can do a fire zone, which is, and Garyu AS is the first male character to set down a fire zone. So he is the first male character to set down a fire zone, like any kind of zone whatsoever. Um, who else was there to set? I mean, mostly females, the female units have a zone setter, like with, um, like, AS4, in which I recently got, has, you have slash, wind, and fire. Um, I actually have all of them except for the magic zone. So, I have AS Annabelle for water zone, uh, AS Claude for wind zone, AS Garyu for fire zone, Yipfa for Blunt Zone, Radius and Crest for Slash Zone, and AS4 and for Pierce Zone, and Mumfa for, and Mumfa for Earth Zone. Yes, 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 correct. Crest is the Slash Zone, AS Claude is Wind, and, uh, and AS Garyu and Hardy. Our fire zones. Verse. I mean, there's going to be a second Earth Zone setter, and that's going to be AS Tiramisu. Hello, Flamester! Welcome! I've seen you a, l a bunch of times on coffee drinkers' streams. I've seen you a bunch of times. So I'm see and so I'm happy to see you on stream today. I would like to see like three of the characters are just one on one side and then just Clarte on the other. Like, you avoiding him that much? I mean, Miss Strari has a pair of wings on her back. And we got a prayer script. Okay, we're going to switch in. I'm gonna do that. We gotta get that AF bar up. I'm fishing again. Oh, <laughs> oh speaking of which, I haven't finished ship. Finish fishing. Oh no. That's bad. We gotta heal up. We gotta heal up. Well, good luck on fishing, Flamester. Oh, the beautiful that is the crits. Oh no. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Woo! That could have been not so perfect at all. I mean, I saved a half AF bar, and then we get a sec our second set of Super S gems. And then, we get no shadow after two runs. Okay, let's continue. Let's continue all on- oh gosh, let's continue our runs. We're gonna bring in these guys in. Well, I don't have Victor yet, so, yeah. Think, oh, well, I don't need- I, I could just crit that. <laughs> uh, I mean, I don't regret using Brave Step because it is a critical rate I I increase, but it's a long time. Yeah, true. 
I think I'm just gonna wait it out. I I mean, I am going to be doing some attempts on boss rush today. Um, specifically on stage 3, because I recently beat stage 2 on the previous stream that I did two days ago, so... Not gonna lie, it was the hardest one to beat, and I... I'm... I, I'm... Uh, ha, ha. It was so dreadful. So, do you guys have done any summons on your... You spent some stones on gotcha summons, or... Not. Let me know if you guys did some summoning today, or maybe the other day, or what are some of the things that you were happy about? Like, what is, like, did you get chance scripts, or any kind of treatises, or even a codex? Did you get some of those? Uh, I have yet not. I haven't yet. Oh, I forgot. Oh shoot, that's painful. I need. <laughs> okay, we're going to. We're gonna heal. Ah, uh, wait, how many stones do you have? You have ninety. I'm guessing you have ninety. Chrono stones. My goodness. I mean, uh, I don't. I don't know what to counter. I don't know what to say after that. I tried for E.S. Melina last week, but I probably shouldn't have. And I did get a codex earlier and a Chan tonight running VH Penguins. Ah, okay. You're running VA. You're running very hard Minglins Castle. Speaking of which, I haven't run in that dungeon for a for quite some time now. I've been running a lot on yeah, I do singles every day. <laughs> oh, goodness. Save up your stones a bit sometimes, Flamester. Ah, I see. Well, for my Aldo, I haven't increased any of his life. <laughs> to be fair, I need to just bring my boy back and grind out his light soon. Ooh, nice. You got yourself a Remitator. A remitted her trees for Rosetta. Um, the only zone that I am lacking is the magic zone, so I am wishing that I would get a remitted her treaties. Ooh. Ooh, that's wonderful. A true string puller. Are those grass dust? Are those grass dust you're mentioning there? Yuri Ah, okay. I have yet to do any of the VC Grastas. Hina's and Pominas. Well, do you have Hina by chance? Do you actually have Hina? Cause since the tomes drop a lot from English. Ah uh, yeah, that's true. I did get a few string puller tomes from Minglins. Oh, lucky! But I want to ask, how good is Hina? Because aside from her having into the game now um, during the twist of the main storyline, um, it also helped increase the DPS rate of Felmina because she was part of the sep she was also part of Hina's banner. So how good is she? Oh, you're missing Blunt Zone. Well, currently the two units that can do blunt zone are Yifa and soon AS Mumfa. There are so many units I don't have yet and like I'm not really an OG, but I have been playing this game for a year and a half now, so I've been playing this game since I saw that Persona 5 collaboration. <laughs> I swear, I was on a I was on a hype train for Persona 5. Ah, I see. I mean, I don't see I see every little character like even if I don't use them as much, I don't see them as like super underrated. Like I use them for any kind of tactic. Like I use AS Saki for certain like Bo horror bosses or just like I needed a good 
I um water attack maybe like I don't have mighty so that has me cut out for that that has me cut out for that and the murmur script we get a murmur script we can just bring in these guys I'm rearranging okay this is the this is my way of doing um I'm glad I have you uh, when her AS releases in global. Yeah, I do have Yifa too, but I already have Yifa to begin with. No flex, just gonna flex. By the way, I did have Yifa, so we're good to go. The weird thing about Kina is her best attack is blind. Oh really? Well, it's oh well. It's, ah, so even though she's not a top tier unit, wait. Her own, like, how many, I need to look her up. I, good thing I have the wiki site. <laughs> wait, 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 wait a second. I need to focus on the battle, but luckily I haven't touched it. Okay, so she is a katana wielder, but her attack, her main, at her big attack is Dark Tool Calamity and Karakuri Tempest. I mean... I mean, if you continuously use Karakuri, like Karakuri Temptus, like it's a preemptive wind type slash attack, and it's oh, it negatives negative fifty percent on speed. Oh, that's eighty percent chance on three turns. That's big. Well, I don't have her yet, so I don't get to experience what it's like to have Hina in a unit. In a unit. Oh, I forgot the lunatic. Well, no, no worries. We can just kill it. Perfect. Woohoo! I forgot to lunatic um Mistrare, but no never mind. We could just kill we can I mean fight crystal with crystal. That's what we always like to say. I wait okay. Oh who was that? Uh Flynn, I think one OG. Ah oh yeah, I did have a sto I have a few stories like a uh, blank Minor treaties. That is for AS Leclerc. And I don't have a AS Leclerc or any form of Leclerc whatsoever. So let's continue. And then we're gonna do some Garulia dungeon runs. I don't know which one to gr run through. What do you guys think? I'm gonna let you decide on what Garulia dungeon you want me to run. So when we reach the zero on the um, red keys, I'm going to let you decide whether I go to Antiquity, Present, or Future Garulia. I'm going to let you guys decide on that one. Unfortunately, I don't have channel points yet on the channel because it's not affiliated yet, but do you have... Uh, um, not yet. I think I collected all level 3 Grastas from present and not in antiquity yet. I have not yet done that. And aside from okay, antiquity isn't great. I'm doing it now just to have them. Well, yeah, I'm I'm just basically collecting them. Antiquity. So you guys want me to go to antiquity? You guys don't want me to go to future. I mean, and pick up extra pain. Ah, oh, okay. I can do that. I can do that because I need to grind out Garu's shadow anyways. We gotta switch them around a bit. Perfect. Uh, we're gonna put them on front. Okay, that's perfect. Okay, we got a rare map! Sweet! 
I hope we can get something good in here, though. That's gonna be the big old H question of a rare map. Does it have anything good or something bad? Garyu is the best with the three units. Mm -hmm. Well, I just recently got a 5-star Azami from a recent stream that I did. From a previous stream that I did. And I re-uploaded onto my second channel, which you guys should check out. If you prefer watching streams on YouTube, then I'm just... Okay, we got a prayer script. <laughs> but if you guys like watching my streams, like if you want to watch them from time to time, then you can check out my second channel mellow streams and shorts and that's my second channel where i basically re-upload my streams okay that's good big horror boss i don't like your gleaming axe attack because it blinds the enemies i hate it so much i'm glad you're gone from this another dungeon well, not technically gone, but still, gone. <laughs> that I do. I, I've seen a bunch of people complaining about AS Filmina not being good. What are they talking about? AS Filmina is wonderful. She can do a stun on ballet eclatant on all enemies. Well, not all enemies, but like with bosses, it doesn't have a really high standard of a really high ratio percentage of you can get of the enemy getting stunned like see this is a good standard of having an AS Felmina if you guys want to I mean AS Felmina was the first first single another single pull that I did when her banner dropped like I was playing another Eden and when her banner dropped I instantly got her on the first pull like I was shook. I even posted about it on Facebook. <laughs> Just sharing my progress. And nobody has heard really much of this game, so I want to make- I really wanted to try and make this game go a bit bigger, but it does have a- it does have a good community, a very good community. I haven't used AS Filmin as much. Oh, love NS. <laughs> I mean, true. It does. I mean, Ns Felmina has a manifest weapon, and she is a great wind blunt attack DPS. But with Ns Felmina, it's really good, especially if you're looking for instant stun and you want to outspeed like certain units. Then that's my game. Okay, gotta get that AF bar up. <clears throat> switch, switch, switch. Perfect. Two more reports. Not a single chance. done with. Also, um, aside from playing another Eden all the time, um, I've recently been watching, I recently watched part 2 of the Rad Brad playing through Final Fantasy 7 Remake Intergrade, which has the story of Yuffie K Kisaragi. I don't really know much about Resident Evil, Resident Evil, Final Fantasy 7, like, I, d ah, a gate! Nice. What did I say? Yes, I know Resident Evil 7. I've watched a few gameplay videos of it, but I never finished it completely. I watched the entire final Resident Evil 8 or Resident Evil Village. I watched all gameplay of that, and the ending was so flippin' sad. Tell me you cried at the end of Resident Evil Village. Or, as what the British call it, Resident Evil Villiard. I'm not blame- I'm not- I'm not shaming them, but still. It's the first time I've heard of it. Okay. Let's hope... Let's hope my luck will turn around and reach the end. 
Streamers, look! Please. Yes! But the problem is, which ladder do I go? <laughs> which ladder do I go through? Yuri, Flamester, I'm letting you in your hands. Which ladder do I choose? Left? But which one? <laughs> first? First? Second? Or third? Far left. First? I haven't played Resident Evil. <laughs> I, have, I mean, I played Resident Evil 6, and some people say it's bad, but I don't care. Resident Evil 6 is the best. Okay, let's go first. I'm. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that was unpog. That was not poggers. I mean, still, I let you choose the faith in your hands. Okay, let's go through one more, and then we can go to Antiquity, because you said, you all said so. <laughs> do you think I should do a single pull on stream? Like in my last stream, I did three single pulls, and I didn't get anything. I was summoning it on the Blunt Zone Attack Series? Blunt Attack Series? Just gonna crit. Crit, crit, crit! This is like Pokemon, it's like, don't crit, but then in another eat it just like, crit! And then when the enemies strike, don't crit! <laughs> Please don't crit. Okay, thank you, Yuri. You're kind. I'm doing Blunt Banner. Ah. Aiming for that ES! ES! So... As we were on the subject of Resident Evil, I played Resident Evil 6, but I never finished the entire game. I have yet to beat Ada Wong's campaign, because I was too scared. Yes, I am very scared. Like, I think I told this story once in a stream, but I can't remember. But I will repeat this, will repeat this story once more. So, it was like a few years back, my parents and my brother bought a PS3. And it was the first time I was seeing a video game console as a child. Like, my very first console was a PS3. Oh, well, not a technically. My first, I think my portable console was the um, PSP, PlayStation Portable. I played a lot of Bomberman on that game, on that, on that console. It was like the best experience ever. And aside from that, um... There was also this other game called God Eater, and I was like, ooh, what is this game? I played it, and then my brother told me you can only use one save file because there's only three save file slots. So I played through God Eater, and I could never get past the next level because I was too scared. And I was just realizing, like, this is a Monster Hunter game. <laughs> and I was like, uh, okay, we're just gonna wing it, I guess. Okay. I want to play God Eater. Ah, oh, what what kind of version though? I mean, obviously we have God Eater Resurrection, which is like the more enhanced version of God Eater. I played God Eater Burst, and that was like an extended and like God Eater Burst. It's an extended storyline to the original. Because I know the entire storyline of God Eater. Like, the first God Eater game was based, loosely based with Shio, a an origami girl. And then, in God Eater Burst, you will be saving Lindo from 
like from transform from further transforming into an origami and these are spoilers by the way i played through the entire game like i want to talk about it so bad and um in god eater resurrection there is a story after a story like once you defeat once you save lindo from probably gonna get the first game if it's on ps4 ah okay well god eater god eater it, the first god eater game was really really good i have not played god eater 2 ah yes god eater anime i watched the god eater anime 2 oh and here's a funny story um so I was in fifth grade, okay? I was in fifth grade, and it was during a class with my English teacher and advisor. Um, shout out to him. I won't be saying his name, but shout out to him. Um, during our discussion, he pulled out his phone, and when he approached my seat, like, I was, like, in the third row of my class, and the seat that I, and my seat was near an aisle, so like down the middle aisle in the classroom so when he approached my chair when he approached my seat my teacher my english teacher he's a cool guy by the way he is really into video games and when he showed his phone screen to me i immediately gasped and like <gasps> I picked, I grabbed his phone, and then, and then, and, and then, after he showed me, like, the screen he was showing was of his pro, of his character in God Eater Burst, and immediately just grabbed his phone, and then he was, he was cool with it, he was cool. He was cool that I grabbed his phone because, well, I, I think it was during the time in class, like, before he, I even told him about it, like, I told him that I watched, I was into anime back then, and when I watched God Eater, I immediately said to my teacher, Teach, sir! And I called them teach. I, I, we always called them chur. Like, when you say teacher, I was like, chur. And <laughs> it's, it's really a reminiscent from the past, though. So, when I said to him that I watched, like, the new episode of God Eater, he told me he watched all the way up to episode 4 and I was like, WHAT?! And I was so shocked. Yeah, he's a really cool guy. He's a really cool teacher. And he was one of like... I mean, he is... On a, on a side note, he is rather strict when we get into a bit of trouble in class. But he's a really fun guy. I'm not gonna, and I'm not gonna lie about that. <gasps> oh no. Don't. 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 Okay, I thought... Okay. It only... It only blocked my brave step, so we're good to go. So, okay, continuing in the story. Um, I... When he showed me that screen of his on his phone that he was playing God Eater Burst on the emulator, um, I immediately took his phone and just, like, What? 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 How? I was like, I was so confused, because I played God Eater Burst on the actual... Um, console that it was for and it was the PlayStation Portable. I played it on PSP. So, okay, we got another gate. Sweet. And with that, um, it was a really bonding experience. And then during class, when he was, when he went to sit down and then he was, he started playing game, he started playing God Eater Burst on the game, all the boys crowded around him. And being the only female that walked up to that te walking up to my teacher, I took his phone and I was like, I wanna play, I wanna play. So I decided to play and then I got into one of the missions. I think I had um I think I had Shio, Soma, and Shun Ogawa. I played a single mission on my teacher's phone and playing God Eater first, and I was like the best moment ever. The best moment ever. <laughs> okay, let's go, window. I don't... It was like the best moment you could ever get from <laughs> chilling with the teacher. And it wasn't even break time, too. It was like during class. And there was no CCTV cameras around... Oh god, why? There was no CCTV cameras during that time, too, so, yeah. 
And when we reached, when I reached junior high school, we weren't allowed to use our phones during class or just like use any type of gadget during class or in between breaks. So yeah, there was a lot of rules to bend and I was not one of them. Wow, yeah, he's a really cool teach. I, if he's ever watching this stream, he would go like, yeah, that's my student right there. <laughs> okay, let's go for, let's rearrange our team for a second. Let's bring in my, okay, we can use the other team. Let, let's go shadow party. Yes! Let's go to Garulia. <laughs> oh, it's just a, okay. I'm back. Sorry for the delay, but I am back, and I didn't realize that I have four four flipping viewers. Uh, 
Okay, see ya, Flamester, Flamester, and thank you for the follow! Thank you so much! Okay, let's go through Garulia Antiquity. Okay, I'm going to the God Waters, Water God Swamp. Let's go for it. Why don't you use your dog boot? Nistine, hi! Oh, I'm saving it. <laughs> I'm saving it. I mean, I don't have much use for it, but still. Hi, Nistine. How are you doing? <laughs> so, I had a men I mentioned earlier about how my schedule is going to go for these streams. So I state that every Tuesday to Saturday, I'm going to be streaming, which is a reasonably good um, time like schedule for me because on Mon and on Sundays and Mondays I don't stream because on Sunday I would have to do we would me and my mom would be having a live stream from to a mass. So yeah, I yeah, I'm not gonna be revealed too much, but I'm just gonna go with it. And on Mondays, um, I won't be streaming because if I stream on Monday, then I wouldn't have the reset of Super S Gems or the Key Grind. <gasps> Dogu's Domain! We're going there. We're going there! We're going to Dogu's Domain. And if we get Zombie on the next one, that would be great. Superior Dogu. And I have 12 of them! I have 12 dogus. Are still are you getting jaded for turning them into food? um not I think I already I think uh, <laughs> uh, uh I'm saving them I don't know what I'm gonna be, I mean there were a few people in the area of Godaro that I have yet to talk to much because I already completed I already grabbed all of the tier 3 grastas from all the boys and that's it so I'm just collecting a bunch of these don't goose just for fun we're going to attack I forgot that it's weak to I can't heal my god I can't heal guard okay I'm gonna use guardian field instead We're going to just switch them out. We're going to do that. Perfect switch. Because I believe it's going to use bur it's going to use a. Oh no, it's speedy roll. Oh, at least we got the debuff. Hit it! Oh, I forgot I have only two. Yeah, true. So we have. I forgot your name. I forgot what it's called. We have. Sushino Gunme. Or. We have. Big Gonjiro. We're gonna do Big Gonjiro because it's weak. Weak! To Earth type attacks. Let's go. Let's get it. Biggie is best. Biggie Gonjiro! It sounds like Tanjiro. From. Demon Slayer. We're gonna get a full- I hope we can get a full AF bar from this. Plus fragment attacks are the best fragments. Yes! I actually wasted a lot of attack fragments. I didn't realize it until like- until like, oh, I need to get more.
Ouch. Okay, that was just a poison tube. And we get a full AF bar. Let's go. Okay, we don't want to waste our time on the stream, so... Let's get it! Okay, we're gonna just do that. Increase my health a bit. Perfect. And then we get the finisher! So I am actually trying to make sure that the stream goes well. Currently, we're at almost in an hour, and the stream didn't s suddenly abrupt or stop. So I am doing this, I'm checking my stream, I'm looking at the chat through my laptop, so we're good to go. And then we got our another set of Subarest gems, and we don't get anything else. <sighs> well, let's just, let's just continue. So, Nistine, um, if you've missed earlier, um, I recently talked about how I beat AS Tuva's Manifest Weapon. So, that had that cut out for me, and I used Will Mac, um, aka Gamer Dad's strategy of having Mana, Marielle, AS Claude, AS um, Yuri, and Felina. So when I used that when I used that strategy, I didn't have Arrow Thrust at the time, so I only had Arrow Magic, and I put it on Marielle so that we can get the most amount of damage with wind type attacks. We can do that. Licorice Blossom. Okay, don't crit me. Why? I was gonna get a triple, triple, triple attack. Well, whatever. We could just get the triple attack from Chaos Saber. To prayer scripts, not bad, but we're gonna take that. And this might be my first first stream in a while that I have get have gotten a lot of um, views. Cause number four or five view four views is a big number on my stream. I don't usually get that amount of people watching my stream, but it's really a refresher to see that. <laughs> Another Dogu's domain in the distance. I went through Water God Swamp, and then we get Dogo's Domain. <laughs> How you like that? But I do need Zombie, though, to heal. Because I don't want to use my food. And we got 13 Dogus. Superior Dogus. We got Talagana Mountain Trail. Water God Swamp? We'll take it. We'll take it there. We'll switch them out. Okay, let's go. Biggie, biggie. Okay, don't. Okay. Phew. Phew! Let's hit it! You gotta heal up my Garyu. My Garyu boy. And then we got the triple attack from those skulls. Nice. And then we can Requine Bouquet. Get another slash attack and end it with Chaos Saber, cause my Gariu be slow. <laughs> okay, we have Sacred Beast or who else? You guys choose. You guys choose. Who do I go against? Sacred Beast or the other one? Ouch. Okay, if you don't. Just don't mind the sound behind me. It's so loud. Why does it have to be loud? And Sushi no Bunme. Um, okay. Okay, I'll be right um I'll be right back guys. I'll be right back. BRB. <laughs> oh gosh. There's a big tr there's a truck outside. Okay. 
I just need to VRB. I need to grab some water. Whichever one isn't Dogu King, if Biggie isn't there, then I'm gonna take on Sushi no Bunme because one, I have Yuri, Biaka, and Garyu. And when the core is out, it's weak to magic. So we'll have to do an AF bar for this one to make sure that we can get this right. <laughs> go, 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 go! Go, go, go! Go, 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 go! You gotta be fast. You gotta get that crit rate up. Perfect. Just gotta get up her wind attack. So we can easily do it with refugal. Get up her wind. Okay, we need to get refugal right now. Or else I won't be able to crit. Perfect. <laughs> strategy! Calculation strategy! Okay, it's exposed. We can do this. We can do a bit of healing. Take it down. Boom! Easy work! Even if you told me not to do it with the Dogu King. Even if you told me not to go to Sushi no Bunme. Or just let me go with the Sacred Beast. I'm gonna take down... I'm gonna take down Sushi no Bunme. And we got the Power of Pain staff. And a shadow too. Sweet! Sheesh! <laughs> I love saying that now. Sheesh! Sheesh! I, I can't do it anymore. Okay, we need to buy some keys now. Okay, I clicked on the wrong person. How much Garyu shadow do you have? Let me check. Oof, I clicked the wrong person. 62! We're close to that nice number. <laughs> We're close to that noise number. And my, okay, I'm gonna show you what my highest light is. My highest light is 53, and highest shadow is 62. I've been slacking. <laughs> Let's buy some keys! Noise. Okay, I can't hold anymore. We're gonna do eight so we can easily, you know, even numbers, people. I like to see even numbers. Stop flexing. My Azami is like four. Four light. And I have yet to increase her. Increase her power. Okay, I'm using the wrong team, but I did have Deirdre at the front. I've been playing this game... A year and a half now. I've not been playing any longer. <laughs> I did not. I went through present Garulia too many times. Okay. We did three. Okay, this is my third attempt on Antiquity Garulia. We're moving on to three times on present Garulia so we can increase Azami's light. There, you happy? You're happy, Nistine? <laughs> okay, Hoshiki Forest or Talagana Mountain Trail? We're going to... <laughs> Nistine! Let's go through here. Forest, cause gar you. Okay, let's deal with this. Lower down its power and intelligence. 
Oh, Ver <laughs> Garu is not condoned to forest fires. Perfect. Forest Water God Swamp. We have Water God Swamp or Kuruchi Cove. I'm going Water God Swamp because I want those chests. We're gonna bring out Garu because he is. Only you can perfect. <laughs> of course, I will. Why did I say Water God? It's Dragon God. Ouch. That was a painful slap from a fish. I should have brought a glass of water with me. Okay, let's let's take this guy down now, shall we? Let's go. Hit it with all we have. It did not stun. But at least we lowered down its power. And intelligence too. We're gonna use Azure Wolf Strike. Thank you, Yuri. Thank you for being so not so flexy like Nistine over there. Hmm. <laughs> sure. Oh. <laughs> Ouch. Yes or no? Do you have anyone? No. I don't have anyone over. I. Are you talking? To Who? I never mind. I don't- I don't want to look at chat anymore, <laughs> even though there's three people. <laughs> Dogu's Domain or Zami? Which do I go? Which do I go? Which do I go? Oh, which do I go? What do you guys think? Yuri, Nistine, and whoever that person is on the other end, who is the third viewer, which do I go? Dogu's Domain or Zami? Hmm? I got two of the rare maps here. Which do I go? Which do I go? Dogu always. Yuri, do you have any? I'd rather say Dogu's domain, but you have a lot. But you do have a lot. Hmm. Um. Okay, I'm going by your guys' vote. I'm going to get my 14th Dogu superior Dogu. Dogu's domain. Let's go. I mean, I don't need to heal, unless my enemy is like, Big Gonjiro. We have, Sacred Beast, or, Big Gonjiro, let's go! We're doing it. We're taking down Big Gonjiro. We're taking down Big Gonjiro. Okay, let's switch them out. I'm gonna switch out Yuri because his his MP is so low. To be fair, one of the 120s is because I dumped 40 sword light into Miyu. To be fair, part of the no food brigade are you? I do have food, but I don't like using it because I like to save it. And if I go to zombie, it would heal. So there you go. We're gonna use this attack. Get that crit rate up! Do you think she can kill? Oh no, she can't finish it off! It's too strong, it's too thick! I do that. Perfect. Let's go, boys! I'm gonna heal up. Aww. 
same. I don't have AS for Miyu or AS Shield, but I do have her treatises. And speaking of which, I am going to talk about 5 Star Mei because she just dropped on the JP side, and the way you upgrade her to a 5 star is with one chant and 30 blacksmith psalms. Or Sams. I wanted two badge slots, so I threw them in there. Oh, so glad. Yes! We got a four-star unit with a five-star class now. And Prize getting her fi his five-star too. So, and Faint and Fiend too. And what about Galliard? Hello? Is no one paying attention on the WFS side that Galliard needs to get a five-star and unlocking his secret unknown ability? Yes, I know. Yeah, I know. And yes, I know about Chiyu getting a 5-star soon. Chiyu, Chiyu, another style. And then Nagi ES, Nagi extra style, and Sheila, another style. So, Okay, I'll say this because when I was watching the live stream on the JP side that they did on last June 9th, I said in the chat that AS Victor looks so much like you know I'm men who I'm gonna mention I, you know what I'm gonna mention right <laughs> AS Victor looks like Tartaglia or child from Genshin Impact you don't see it well I do <laughs> I've watched too many Genshin Impact pictures and I just see the resemblance in AS Victor and child Yeah, that's true. Oh, yeah. Mm. You'll doubt that you'll see Galliard Helena stuff in the KMS Mythos. I mean, KMS Mythos is going to be an interesting one because Mythos is just like a different storyline. I wonder if it's going to have any connections with the main storyline, though. That's the question. Like, considering that we left off on a big cliffhanger, and yes, I'm going to be streaming once the big end, once the big update drops, I'm going to be streaming that. But how in the world did Master the one in the space-time rift, and the Gall Gallery of Dreams Master are all the same person. It's like, it's Aldo, then Master, then the Gallery of Ga Dream Gallery Master. How is that possible? So many, so many questions that needs to be answered. Uh, yeah, that's true, but what if there's gonna be some kind of relations to Mythos and the main storyline? Like, it's a curious question, and like, there are, there, imagine there would be stuff. Um, KMS is tied in all sorts of things, and it will probably explain a lot about Suzette, Isaka, Dewey, etc. Oh yeah, that's true! Uh, unfortunately, I don't have Suzette, but I do have Isaka and Dewey. I wonder if Dewey's gonna have another style, have an, another style form. Ooh, Leobok! Oh, I remember that guy too. Ooh, that's true. Why is KMS trying to perfect humanity? I mean, they are living in the future and trying to, you know, make sure that all humanity is, like, perfect in, in a sort sense. I'm getting way too lore here, people. This is not a lore-based stream. It looks new and stuff. Aha! Uh -huh. Interesting. So, by the way, you guys want me to see a single pull? Want me to do a single pull? The Kronos clan. Oh, yep. So Amy, yeah, probably Amy might play a part too. Pretty sure the characters in the f no, not a single. <laughs> I'm not wasting my stones. Neo human. Huh. You got some good theories over there. It's just a theory, a game theory. I'm not. <laughs> Imagine. I mean, MatPat did do. A Chrono Trigger Street, a Chrono Trigger Theory, and yeah, we're just gonna we're just gonna go with it. Um, I already have Shigure to begin with. I'm just gonna collect his materials to be upgraded to an AS form. And besides, I already have a Water Zone Setter, and that's AS Annabelle. But here's my boy right here. Such a beauty, so beautiful. I love his long hair when it, like, flows down from the, from the, <laughs> my fan theory is that Grandpa Mayor is the Thunder King. 
I have a crackpot pet theory about Aldo that I think is almost as crazy to be true. What is your crackpot pet theory? I mean, yes, Aldo is not really the original brother of Fiend, who is... I forgot their name. I forgot their name! <laughs> okay, you guys, okay, I'm gonna do a single pull. <laughs> We're doing a single pull, but which banner? What do you guys think? Which do I go? The blunt? The slash, the pierce, the magic, heck and talkery, or sneal gay, sealed nade, sealed nade, or uella, magic. Mhm. Mm magic. Can can we just appreciate the fact that? Okay, I'm gonna talk about this. I'm gonna rant. Can we appreciate the fact that Dunarith is just like I've seen memes of this. Dunarith looks like a K-pop star. <laughs> He does look like one. Or a J-pop star. I prefer J-pop more than anything in the entire world. Sorry, K-pop stands. I apologize. I don't want to get... I don't want to get cancelled, please. I mean, I'm a small... I'm a small streamer, so I can't get cancelled. <laughs> but yes, we're going to do magic. You can either get... He did get sick. <laughs> yes. I mean, Dunarith, normal style, pretty, like, calm. But then he broke out his true form. He would be in a K-pop band or a J-pop band. I just see it. I just see it. Okay, we're doing one single... One single pull. Ready? I believe this is gonna be a bronze door. Predictions? A bronze. <gasps> Silver. <laughs> Okay, who is it going to be? It's probably nothing. We get foreign. <laughs> okay, you're going on. Well, Cyrus is there. Oh my, you guys are just talking about so many theories. I mean, I am a big fan of theories. I do sometimes make my own theories, but still, you're going at it. <laughs> I want to see a whole entire community of another Eden theories right now. Just a whole other community. We only got foreign, which is good. Yes, I do have her AS form, um, right on here. Okay, we're going- Okay, this time we're going to- Okay, let's- Can we just- Okay, I'm gonna just appreciate- Hi, Joker. Hi, Violet. Hi, Morgana. Hi, Skull. My Phantom Thieves of Hearts members. If they ever did part three of the Persona 5 collaboration, they, I would add Crow here, and I would add Queen. I would love a Persona 5 Part 3 collaboration. Please make it happen. <laughs> I want to get Crow. He's going to be a Crystal and Shade unit. <clears throat> That's my prediction if, it, if they're ever going to add Crow. Okay. Let's go to present Garulia Dungeon. We're going to bring bring out the big guns. <laughs> A non-sword person. <clears throat> well, the problem is, Crow is a sword user in the game of Persona 5. Yes, I know that. He is a... Agree, no more non- <laughs> Well, if they ever did part 3 of Persona 5 collaboration, if they would ever add um, Noir, she would be using an axe. If they ever add Noir into the game, um, if they added Queen or Panther, um, Panther is a whip user, so that would mean she would be a fist user. And if they ever add Queen, she is a fist user, so... Okay. Okay, I already have my cat, Emma's. Okay, I'm gonna grab the cat, I'm gonna grab the Enhance If Match Match. Okay, that's all done. Kun Moon Mountains or Jiraiya Fortress. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, if they ever add, well, obviously, I know all the characters in the game, so Oracle is not going to be a good unit because she doesn't fight. 
Um, if they ever add Fox into the game, he would be a Katana user. Um, Queen and Panther would be Fist users, and Noir would be an Axe user. <clears throat> Oh my goodness. We're gonna do that. Oh! Three! What? We're gonna do it. Well, thank you for letting me know. Is that all of them? Ah! Oh. Let's appreciate this place. It's so beautiful. Oh, see? <laughs> Kitsune mask. Oh, okay, a shrine. This? Offer the cat Anna at the cat Tokura. Ooh. What do they give? A jade of attack. That's great. Okay, Jiraiya Fortress or Kunlun Mountains? Where do we go? I'm letting you decide that. Oh well, at Naj Nagsham, I only get jaded of attacks. So... Mm. Uh, let's just go to Jir Let's just go- uh, Let's just go to Jiraiya Fortress. <laughs> Cause... The enemies there are weak to certain attacks. We're gonna put him at the end there. I love rearranging my team. <laughs> and this is perfect. Perfecto. Easy. Oh, shoot. Well, that was painful. Just attack. Even if it just guards. Let's go. So, tomorrow I am not going to be streaming another Eden. I'm going to be streaming um, Final Fantasy Dissidia Opera Omnia. So you're going to be seeing a different game that I would normally wouldn't play on the channel. But it's a good experience. I love playing Final Fantasy this is the Opera Omnia, and if you know me for a long time, then it's the first ever gacha game I've ever played in my entire, like, I've played a bunch of gacha games, but it, Final Fantasy this is the Opera Omnia holds a dear sweetheart, dear sweet place in my heart, because I played it two, over two years ago, and it's the, it's like on my old iPad, and my when I rewatched the videos, I was like, my voice is so squeaky. Okay, it healed. We don't care, because it's weak to earth. Okay, we got Nagsham up there. And what's over here? Okay, prayer scripts. Not the best, but I'll take it. Wait, more squeaking than now? <laughs> I mean, I'd like to say that, that my voice was rather squeaky before. I was like 12 years old when I started my YouTube channel. <laughs> and that's no fact. I did start my YouTube channel back when I was 12 years old. It was back in 6th grade. Uh, so many fond memories. They don't heal. I was supposed to do some grinding today. I was supposed to do, um, boss rush, but I think this is gonna be the last. I think we're just gonna do present guerrilla last, and then we can go to boss rush attempts. You know what? I'm just gonna change my stream info. I'm gonna change it. I'm gonna change it! We're going to just change the titling of this video. We're just going to change the title 
just changing it out to just key grinding because I did this already almost an hour and a half now okay my thing is lagging okay perfect I'm just gonna change the titling just key grinding So, oh god. Okay, I changed it to key grinding and random discussions because we like to do random discussions. <laughs> okay, tell me. Vermilion Road or Kunlun Mountains? <clears throat> tell me. You decide. Mountain. Okay, let's go to Mountain now. Let's bring in my strong team. I like rearranging stuff, okay? I like to arrange a lot. Let's collect these junk pieces. Wonder if Good Mackie will like. Oh yeah, Good Mackie! I forgot. Um, I don't know if Good Mackie will ever get a five star, and if if ever he does, if ever it does get a five star. I wonder what it would look like. That's the question. Would it look like a real life? Popor Yes, Poporo. Or even... Who else? There are so many good characters that you can get at a 5-star class with. Like, Darunis, Nomar, <laughs> Soyera, um, Palm. 5-star <laughs> Palm would be fantastic for the people of this community. Okay, we got Suzaku. And the other one, we have Karakuri. Yes, they should have it all. I mean, Fei and Five Star is coming, and May Five Star is true. So Nomar and Darunis need to get a Five Star class. Let's go to Karakuri. Oh, hello. I'm just gonna take you down. Easy work. Karakuri, let's go! Just cause he is interested- Ah, oh, Raven! Yes! Raven would have a beautiful 5-star class if he ever did get one. Ouch! That's painful. We're just gonna do that continuously until we get a full AF bar. Oh, never mind. It doesn't get a full AF bar. So seven is getting a five star. The last idea kids. Ah, yes, five star seven. That would be really cool. Okay, that's kill. Easy win. Um, who else would have a five star class? Um, Yasuki, the Sky Pirate. She would watch you. I would love. For her to have a five star class. And Krevo, and. I'll say this. Um, who was the other guy again? Um, who was it again? I forgot. His enemy, his rival. Krevo's rival. Who was he again? <laughs> forgot his name. AS Ruina needs a manifest. Yes. AS Ruina has Nonald got it. Keep forgetting this guy. He's so annoying. <laughs> He was so annoying during the Azure Rebel um, side quest episode thing. Okay. Nistine, choose drawer, window, or bed. ES Palm will never happen. Window? Let's see. Aha! Let's go for it. Pawn next. Uh huh. Let's go for the pawn. Shall we go in? I was sure this is gonna get reverse psych. I knew it. I was gonna reverse psychology it.
I love the fact that the, when the music is the, at the perfect timing, like when the cat like does its paw stamp, it joins up well with the music. It's like, it's like a, it's like amazing. Okay, let's bring it back. Let's go one second run. Let's go. <gasps> Cat Shrine or Kunlun Mountains. Mm. Cat Shrine. <laughs> We're going Cat Shrine, people. Cat Shrine. Uh, I didn't use a cat Emma beforehand, so I'm just gonna go with it. <laughs> Maybe in the next stream we will do some boss rush attempts and probably do future Garulia content. Um, future Garulia under the dungeon. So we have Inari Plateau or Spectre Palace. Which do we go? Which do we go? Which do we go? Oh, which way do we go? Palace, unless you need junk. I don't really need junk. We're going in! Okay, we're gonna rearrange this team. Let's make it more flattering. And besides, everything in here is weak to wind. Except for the... Except for the ones that look like lizards. Everything is weak to wind type attacks. Yeah, and the Mysterious Lantern, too, so we forgot about that. But, aside from that, majority of this majority of the enemies here are weak to wind-type attacks. Well, most specifically, wind and blunt. No, that was an insta-kill. That's painful. Yes! <coughs> My voice. I should have brought a glass of water. Okay. We have Nagsham. We're going there next. I don't need your help, Steam. Sorry. We're going to Nagsham immediately. We need to heal. But you can choose the boss that we're going to be facing. It's all up to your- it's all in your hands and whoever that other person is. It's all up to you. <clears throat> okay, let's check it. Jaded of attacks, all of them are jaded of attacks. Okay. Buy up the items. Okay. We'll do it. That way it changes. I mean, I basically bought every single tier 3 um, grass dozen here. Basically, I think. I don't know, it might change when we go here next. Okay, we have Ghastly Mizushi or Karakuri. Which do you prefer? Put it down in the chat. Put it down in the chat. Karakuri. Aha. Thanks. Let's go. Let's bring in my best. Let's bring it in. Oh, I did not tap him. I did not tap his character again. Bring it down.
perfect. <coughs> I need a drink. I'll be right back, guys. I need to get a I need to get a glass of water in this room. Okay, I'm back, and I have a cup of water with me. My throat feels refreshed. Get another light for my dear Azami. Let's go, but no white key. And then, one more. Okay, this time, I'll get to use my cat Emma's. Okay, we're gonna use one at a time. Kunlun Mountains or Vermilion Road. It's like it's like Victory Road from Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, fragment of attacks. Let's get it. Let's go. Okay, they're all up top. <laughs> Let's go directly to the monster. Hey, big guy! What's up? Just, just do it. <laughs> Three slash attacks from one... I feel sorry for the Yeti. <laughs> Die. <laughs> I mean, Tuva. I mean, Tuva is really strong. <laughs> Get the right grass does. Even though I don't have the right grasses for her AS form, I still dig it. Okay, we're gonna bring it down. Bring down the house! Okay, Jiraiya Fortress over there. And the other way is. Specter Palace. I think I'm gonna go to Jiraiya Fortress. Okay, I uh, you read my mind. I said fortress. Cause attack frags. Always go for the attack frags. When you want to get one chest, just one soul chest of one frag attack. And we get crystals of attack. We need to deal with that. Boom, boom, we're gonna heal. Always frag! Okay, that did the job right. That did the job done. Nice. Oh, I forgot to attack. Lone Wolf Storm, I'm sorry. Yes! You hit a zombie purposely, and you got the attack back. I'm sorry. <laughs> what was that? Okay, 
Cleave Shadow. Let's take it down. Ouch, ouch. You're weak to slash? Yeet! <laughs> okay, let's take this die down. We're not gonna use any attacks. Okay, we're switching into a zombie. Okay, Spectre Palace is up there. Number scripts. Noise. Murmur. Ouch. Ouch. Nagsham, we're gonna heal. We're going Karakuri. It's not Kurakuri, it's Karakuri. Do you have any more shadow than light in your teams? I think that I have more shadow than with light. Cause I have my units in one team called the light party and another team called the shadow party. I currently have the shadow party and all in all, all five units except for Azami cause she's a light unit. She um, I have a total of 200 plus shadow, so makes up for a good time, I guess. I'm gonna cast down a Licorice Blossom. Don't hurt Yuri like that. He's my baby. Yes! Attack, attack, attack! Send in the army! Send in the Kraken! Oh no! Please don't die. Oh, thank goodness. Lone Wolf Storm should do the trick. Let's go. Man, that was scary. Okay, we did it. Another Subarus Gems. Nice. And we don't get nothing. I mean, the, cl the scrolls are just like overwhelmingly b big. Okay. Let's buy t two more. Two more keys, because I have two more keys remaining in here. Okay. Okay, let's go through here, one more, and then we can end the stream afterwards. Unless something interesting happens, then maybe. Yeah, okay. We can just replace the cat Emma that I have. Because there's a cat Emma, cat shrine, right there! Oh, why is it lagging? Oof, oof, oof. Let me know, um, let me know if you guys have any other suggestions for games that I can play on my phone. Like, I would like to play a lot of mobile games on stream. So, yeah. Aside from another Eden and just a Diopera Omnia, I would like to play different games, too. So, we're going to Inari Plateau. Because, why not? We're just gonna avoid the boar. Jiraiya Fortress. Um, yeah. Well, I did watch Pocket Gamer Launchpad number four. There were a lot of different mobile games on there that they showcased during the two live streams. But none of them really caught my eye as much. I thought, and I was 
hoping that another Eden would make the cut of appearing in one of their live streams for the launch pad number four. But so far, they, but when I watched it all the way through, uh, yes, I did watch it all the way through, they didn't seem to appear it. Even though Pocket Gamer did state that another Eden is going to be featured in launch pad number four, but it didn't make the cut, so we're just going to wait for new updates to come. And while I was taking my break, uh, before I even started streaming, um, before I started streaming this stream, I saw an announcement for... Yeah, that's true. Another Eden is really not that well known. Unless they do another big collaboration, like, people are familiar with Persona 5, they must have played that, because I played Persona 5, and when I saw Another Eden on the Play Store, I immediately downloaded it because it had Persona 5 in it. So I was hoping that maybe in the near future they would do more collaborations with bigger titles. Like, unless they can get the licensings for it perfectly, fine, then we can, we are good to go from there. It would be really cool for a Final Fantasy, um, for a Final Fantasy collaboration. It would be beautiful. It would be amazing. I got into another Eden when it launched. Ah. I see. I, yeah, that's true because the people behind another Eden created Chrono Trigger and also Xeno Gears, which I've never heard of before. I've never heard of Chrono Trigger until I figured that out, that they were the same people that make Chrono Trigger. I didn't really see it, but I just saw it because it had Persona 5 in it, so why not play the game? Considering I can't really- considering that I'm not really like a big console fan anymore. I used to be a console fan. I played Resident Evil 6 and Adventure Time and The Sims 4. Yes, I played The Sims 4 on my PS3 and my parents- Sims 3, not Sims 4. It's Sims 3, not Sims 4. I did play Sims 4 back in the day when it was still free on like ori Origin and such. So Chrono Trigger is a game. You can play through it in like 20 hours before- that's a long game, and fun fact, another, yes, Chrono Trigger does have a mobile version, but it costs money, and I don't want to, I don't want to do that, so. But to be fair, though, I really wish that they could do, like, I mean, they did, sh like, in notices for the new update, that they showed an entry form of, like, they send out a survey to all players in order to improve the service, and they're gonna give out 30 Chrono Stones on the 17th, I believe? They- I did read one of that, that it's gonna be sent out on the 17th. And, like, I just wish, like, they'd- um, I want to, like, make sure- like, I want to have a certain goal, like, yes, Another Eden is kind of a big game, but it's not really well known. I want to help out in building a bigger community and getting more people in immersed with the game even though they're not like like it's like you're comparing a game with a different game and which do you think is bigger and which do you think is going to come sadly well known I want to make another Eden a bit well known to like the online world and trying to make sure that everyone gets what they want like you can be a free-to-play player, or a paid player, or even more just an RPG-style player, a gotcha player, whatever you whatever you fancy. It's gonna be a great game, and and there's gonna be more content to it, and it's a it's a really immersive, progressive game. And as I state, another Eden is a game of strategy because you can share different strategies of how to beat bosses, um, horrors like what is your setup, what is your Grass to ch what is your grass to load out? What are your weapons, armor, badges? More and more, it's gonna be like, I don't know, it's gonna be like one day that another Eden will be well known, and that's just my, you know, just a way to know, just a way for everyone to let them know that hey, I played this game and I want you guys to try it out. Yeah, and 
to be fair, it really helped out because I did talk to a few of my D Discord friends and they were asking, like, what games do you play? And I was showing another Eden. I was showing, like, oh, you can play this game because it's really fun. It's a free-to-play game. And I encouraged them to play it. And they did. And I think I only did, like, two. The Steam launch helped a bit. Yeah, the Steam launch really helped out. Like, reaching to players who are known for PC gaming. And another Eden dropped. For PC on Steam and yes I do have it on PC too I have it on my laptop as well so it's a really fun game like it's slowly branching out to different branches like it started out as a mobile game and now it's on PC and I wonder if it's still going to progress through with the Switch release because they were planning on doing a Nintendo Switch release for another Eden which is gonna be you know very very interesting and in how it's gonna play out on the Nintendo Switch so I'm very excited for that I just hope that it goes big. I just hope that it's become well known and people can play it. Like, I want there to be a lot of people playing this game because it's really fun. I heard- What? They cancelled the Switch port? You kidding? Is that true? Did they really cancel out the Switch, co Switch port for the game? Well, that's, um, interesting. But if they ever, re like, reconsider it, but still, around when they start to talk- Oh, I see. Well, maybe they can rethink their process of elimination a bit and just think, like, hey, we can do this. Say they would cancel the- they canceled work on the Switch. Uh, well, there's no use about it, but at least the Steam launch made a cut- of being like well known to the other players that play PC games only like like I was showing some of my friends at school like I was showing them hey I play this game you want to put it it might be too hard to port its controls to switch oh yeah that's true because it's like you have to move around a lot and then just doing another force on a switch port that's gonna be tough You have to do a but a lot of button mashing and trying to strategize of which of which moves you want to put in, like for that certain key bind for that certain button bind. So yeah. Anyways, I think that's just where we're going to end off stream. Thank you guys so much for watching. It's already been an hour fifty two. I was hoping that it would reach two hours, but I don't really want it to be that long. So I don't want to keep you guys hanging around too much and. Yeah, thank you guys so much for tuning in with the stream. Um, I only just grinded and I said before that I was going to, you know, oh shoot. Okay, have a good night. Ah, oh, good night, Nistine. Oh, sorry for that. But thank you so much for tuning in with the stream. I will be re-uploading this on my YouTube, so stay tuned for that. And as for now, I'm headed out to my mission, signing off. Bye!